there, they also ra- ran Weaver as an offlane then sometimes for Faith Beyond. Okay. But and Slarter kasi yun din alternatively ginagamit siya ni Faith Beyond or ni Shadow din eh. So very open pa rin for Wings Gaming. Evil Geniuses they don't know what what they're running into pa. Oh, medyo eh, hindi pa malinaw kung ano ang plano for both teams dito. EG, ang alam lang natin, they have a very very good foundation sa kanilang okay, lineup. They have the SD and Luna as their uh, primary source of damage and of course, yung pushing capability nila, they have the clockwork for initiation and of course, it will be universe that will be using that hero. Wings Gaming, they have the Slardar, oh. Weaver, Disruptor, and a Dazzle. Kung mapapansin mo, in uh, line, uh, oh, they have a very good anti armor, very good way to reduce the armor yeah. of the heroes of EG. They have that across the Dazzle Weave, the Weaver, of course, with that uh, yung, uh, swarm, swarm, and of course, Lardar with that amplified damage. They have a very good way of removing armor sa heroes ng EG, and of course, it will allow Weaver and Slardar to deal to dish out yes. massive amount of physical Ridiculous damage. Of damage. Dito. So, down to the last weekend, last band for both teams. No, ano ang magiging pick nila? Yung clockwork actually, crit is notorious for picking clockwork as a support. And ginagawa niya yun sa pubs especially kapag meron siyang shadow demon na kasama. So, this might be a clockwork support. Hindi natin alam. Pero, yun niya eh. Kasi feeling ko, Evil Geniuses, they need much better offlaner than clockwork. True, 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 true. Now, they ban that Enigma. Hmm, curious. I don't think that Evil Geniuses would pick Enigma in the chat. ko pala yung mga kasama ko sa group na D2PC chat group. Nagpapabati sila si Clinton, Tibate ba? Ay, si Clinton. Binabati daw si Clinton na Tibate ba sa bet. Sabi ni Dek Dek. Sila Mumei, si Downy Boom Boom Pow. <laughs> Ang code name nila. Si Comeback is real. Si. Um, si ba to? Si mga mababati mga kasama natin dyan. Si Lilith. Si A.U. Gaben, Boom Boom Pao, Your Inspiration, Inarius. Mga repa pips natin dyan sa D2PC, <laughs> sa group chat namin. Hello. Okay, so tignan natin. Um, last band dito for Wings Gaming will be the Enigma. Sabi ko sa iyo eh, Wings Gaming, hindi sila pumipili ng uh, parehas na hero. Oh. So i- i- kung EG ka, hindi mo na ibaban yung mga ginamit ng Wings oh. ng Game 1 kasi alam mo hindi nila pipiliin yun. Ewan ko kung talagang pinaninindigan ng Wings na ang ang hero eh, pag isang series eh, nag expire na sa kanila sa isang laban. <laughs> Dahil hindi nila uulitin kung ano mang hero ang pinili nila ng game number one. Eh, pinili nila, masisira syempre yun. It's part of their trade eh. Yun talaga yung classic na ginagawa ng Wings eh. Oh. So the band of the Alchemist is actually a good band. Yeah. Kasi may kulang na lang acid spray. Acid eh. spray, minus armor <laughs> din yun. Oh, tama. So, good, good band for... Siguro ano, Weaver will go for a Desolator, uh, an AC later on, <laughs> AC courier, yeah. uh, career. Uh, they have sufficient na... No, so, grabe, mam- mangungulon to sa physical damage. Mm-hmm. Ang lineup ng EG, if ever. It will Lesh be a rock. Lesh Rock, a lag- mm. Lesh Rock last pick dito. On the side of EG, and I think it will be an SD Lesh Rack as their support. Yep. Or will be Luna, mid, wor- mid lane Mirana, and a Clockwork support for Mr. Universe. Dito yep. naman sa side ng Wings, they have the Slardar, Weaver. Uh, Slardar, maybe si Pete Bian yan as the off lane. Weaver for Shadow. It will be Disruptor, Dazzle across uh, Ice, Ice, Ice and uh, Innocence. Innocence. And mid lane ang kulang dito. The hero of Blink. Eh, hindi natin alam. Actually, they can go for an SF if they want. Yep. Uh, Ang uh, SF will be very good with and uh, with that oh. presence of the Dark Lord. Although I think they're eh, gonna pick DA here. Oh, they, Lycan. Lycan. Lycan how? So they mm. will have a Lycan game, mga kaibigan. Both teams pulling up heroes from their pocket. Lash rock for EG. Lycan. Ang uh, mid Lycan. Mid Lycan ng magigita natin dito, mga kaibigan. Ang asong bulul. Like na natin. You are watching the Boston Major coverage of Nineski TV. This is again Duno and I'm with Wolf. Kami ang magbibigay sa inyo ng punto per punto ng aksyon nandito sa Wings versus EG. Evil Genius. What up? Okay. Sige, anong, anong mas pabor mo dito? Kasi I'm favoring Wings Gaming's lineup actually right now. Evil Geniuses will melt against Lycan. I don't think they can control Lycan with... Although they have a lot of disables, Kasi like a very mobile hero, tas meron ka pa Slardar, and 
Uh, I think Ace dito is yung disruptor. Hindi, maraming eh. control pang, hindi ko alam, hindi ko nga gusto yung Lycan, eh, dami pang control lang EG dito sa Lycan. Mm. They have, sabi mo nga, they have the disruptor, of course, they have the Lesh Rock. The clockwork will be a very good uh, uh, way to way catch. Way to kite, yun, diba? Uh, what, to catch and kite itong Lycan dito. They have the Mirana with the Moonlight Shadow. So there is a lot of way for EG to actually deal with this Lycan. Not unless... Wings are planning to push straight up oh, dito yan. sa laban natin. Ito, alam mo, matagal-tagal na akong hindi nakakakita ng 5-man Dotto. Oh. Na mid lane 5-man Dotto. Oh, eh, yeah. Gusto ko makakita ulit doon. Mga cheese strat, pero hindi ko alam. Okay. Uh, EG is very reliant on their combos. Pero they, they have many ways to set up kasi. You have the Disruptor with the Disruption. <laughs> Ay, we, uh, the Shadow Demon with the Disruption into the Leshrak Stun or the Mirana Stun. Tapos, syempre, you have the Luna to dish out the damage. And Leshrak it will be on the hands of Zai. Okay, support, support Leshrak tayo dito. But Leshrak with Soul Catcher coming out from the Shadow Demon dish, will dish out so much damage in the early stages of the game, which could be a problem for Wings. Although, Di Wings... Alam, I don't think it, this is a pushing lineup for EG. Uh, no, that, Maybe that, that, I think they will. the build for the Leshrak will go for that stun and of course that uh, yung uh, slow. Mm -mm. I don't think uh, maaga niya kukunin yung Diabolic oh, dito. I think kukunin yung Diabolic pero hindi niya gagamit yung 4 push. Kasi, ano eh, usually pang kill nila yun eh. And you, do, you won't push put Leshrak on the front lines na ng ngayon eh. I feel, ako feeling ko Lightning Storm yung gagamitin okay. nila dito. Sige, uh, tingin, yung ano, kasi, pang slow nila yun, they have mm -hmm. very good damage na siguro dun sa side ng EG. They have the Lucent Beam, they have the Leshrak Stun, and of course yung mga other yeah. skills niya, Mirana, Starfall, Rocket okay. coming in from the clockwork. Kailangan nila ng way to... Sa so bagay, hindi naman na sa slow si Lycan. Mm. And you, have a, you will have a very hard time on catching the Weaver, especially this early, yeah. uh, kung wala kang sentry. Pero yeah, of course, no this problem. is a pro game. Meron silang mga sentry agad dyan. So this is okay. a Slardar being harassed down by the Shadow Demon dito sa top lane. So, okay. pero ito, magang uh, discard eh, coming in from the uh, Wings. Early aggression coming in from them. They are trying to chip down the health of this clockwork in the bottom lane. Oh, I think Universe will have a, another bad time na naman. Although, ginawa niya kasi last time nag-iron tile on jungle siya. Uh, this jungle. time, Jumangin clockwork siya. doesn't necessarily do good with iron ta iron talon kasi hindi naman siya ganun kaya talaga ang right click na efficient sa jungle so, of course yung damage output ng clock pero ito mukhang huhuli nila here comes the disruption they might get this kill here comes the sun coming in from that lash they are dealing massive amount of damage here on that dazzle and the dazzle will fall as the first blood dito sa laban natin ito so it is again EG striking first dito sa game number 2 and they yep. mean business dito sa game number 2 they want to end this and they want to take out wings yeah, and they want to clip the wings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. They scouted out na ginamit yung Shadow Wave first. So, ibig sabihin, nag-level 1 Shadow Wave at walang Shallow Grave ang Dazzles. Kaya nila, yun yung inula nila dito sa top lane skirmish natin. Oh, okay. So, no. early laning phase natin. Tingin ko magiging passive muna yung uh, dalawang teams natin dito. They will just uh, try to farm yung mga key items nila in order mm -hmm to do kung ano man ang plano nila dito. I think uh, the timing, kung, hindi ko kasi alam eh, di, matagal na tayo hindi nakakakita ng Lycan sa laban eh. So, eto mm -hmm. na. Uh, bago ang lahat ha, may binagpapabate sa buong community. Hello to Liam, Sean, and Randy of Australia, to Thomas, Shoni, Micho, Yumin of Malaysia, and especially to D2TC people who are watching at Mineski TV right now. Dek Dek, Clinton, Sarah, Justin, Jeannie, and Wewe, more powers sa D2PC community na bago kong tinatamba yun sa Facebook. At ayan na, second kill yeah, going Shadow in favor of EG again. Another setup by Shadow Demon. At ang um, malapit dito, yun nga, Mirana from downtown nag-land ng isang arrow enough to secure the kill. Oh, and Demon. Uh, EG, mukhang uh, they are actually looking for early bloods dito. They have used their smoke and they are lurking in that mid lane waiting for that Lycan. Actually, they might catch Lycan dito. They SD will. is leading the way and there's that disruption. The stun to follow up. Arrow With will fly. Arrow, arrow won't connect. Miss. Lycan, however, yeah. is too low and I think he will die sa kamay uh, without ng EG. arrow landing. Yan yung power kasi ng Diabolic Edict then Level 1. Sobrang lakas ng damage. Uh, 
the okay. that diabolic edict nga ang uh, romak dito mm-hmm. and that will be the third <laughs> kill of EG third kill boys evil geniuses mm-hmm. they've noticed ay, they, they've recognized that their win condition is to start picking off yung valuable heroes from the side of wings yes and kung titignan mo yung lineup ng wings it is actually a very dependent core lineup for wings you have a yep. weaver a lycan and a slarder of course slarder will start to get online once he got the dagger but you need to kill him and kill him and all yes. disrupt his farming in order to stall yung progress exactly. of dagger and when the ta- when the dagger comes eh well prepared na yung lineup yep. nyo for that initiation of course weaver a very squishy hero and kailangan niya yung uh, ng item in order to dish out damage nung uh, germany tatak niya eh mm-hmm. mahirap na din yan. so item dependent nga sila rito lycan of course a very item dependent core yeah. pero once na makuha naman nila yung mga items nila they will be effective in pushing yep. and taking down yung mga heroes and of course even towers dito across the lycan howl the wolf and the push ability of that Lycan, eh, mahihirapan yung EG. Well, maganda ginagawa ng EG. Yep. Kasi nga, nakukuha nila yung mga kills early. Yes. And, Wings Gaming's lineup is a very snowball type kind of lineup that they they need to hit their stride and then dun sila mag-ride. Dun sila lalakas. And if they don't hit that... Uy, pero maganda to. And they might get that kill on the wall. clockwork. Connect. Yeah, oy, pero pumasok sila rito but the stun will connect Shallow Grave will allow Weaver to escape will he be able to use the time walk and yes he will and he will survive giving their wings their first kill of the game and but grab your effort to get that first mm-hmm. kill the yeah. clockwork the disruption and clockwork. even the less rock with the TV clockwork Montek nang mamatay ang Weaver do. <laughs> Well, Clockworks, actually, kasi sobrang tagal din na wala na Clockworks sa meta. Nakalimutan natin. Oy, pero here kaunan. comes the backline offensive, mga kaibigan. Here comes the stun. It won't yes. connect. And Clockwork will be able to escape. Tignan natin, he is very low on HP, but he will be able to use the time walk. But nagkamali siya ng nilapitan. It is actually the Clockwork, and he is in range of a set rewards. And this is a dead dazzle giving EG. A double kill and it will be Mr. Universe taking down those two kills, making the score five to one yeah. in favor of the North American powerhouse EG. Wings is not respecting yung pickoff potential na meron yung EG with their support duo. They're pushed so far upwards dun sa tower nila. Pero ito, Lycan, here comes the wolf form. Pero hindi siya makakatakbo. Tignan natin kung abutan. Ginat, gat, narabis, nakatakas buhay! Yun lang. <laughs> Kakabakaba. Sayang ang paglabas ni Jacob, mga kaibigan, ng Twilight. Yeah. <laughs> hindi, hindi niya nakuha yung kill. Very good uh, disruption coming from the Shadow Demon. <laughs> Tamang target yung ano niya eh, yung pinili niya. And not knowing na wala na siyang glimpse, and TP out. It's perfect. True, true, true. At uh, Tignan natin dito, Luna oh, is, uh, with Lesh Rock is taking down that tier 1 tower in the top lane with the use of the level 2 Diabolic Edict, which can easily chip down the health of a tower. Slardar needs to be careful. He is being stalked by the moment by Lesh, pero I don't think gagawa ng offensive move bang Lesh dito. Slardar is sitting at level 4, almost the same level, uh, actually the same level as the Lesh dito. Luna now up with the power dreads. SD on a deep warding mission behind enemy lines. Tignan natin kung magagawa ba niya ang mission niya rito. Mid lane, Mirana for EG. It is actually Zumail uh, in one of his best hero, which is the Mirana. Now, I think that Wings should do something about this. Kailangan nilang mag-initiate na right now. Kasi they have the Lycan ult. I, sh- I think they should have used it for a push or a Roshan attempt. Now, Aray They're ko, getting around the map. Disruptor, hindi ka dapat nandyan at this point in time. At alam mo namang malakas yung pick-off oh, potential ng EG. It. Dapat hindi ka naglalaboy-laboy dyan. And, uh, EG actually playing an almost perfect early game dito. Yeah. They are winning the laning phase in all lanes. Yes. And uh, this is starting to get out of hand for Wings Gaming. 4K network for Luna. Eight minutes into the game, followed by his teammate, uh, the Mirana, with 3-4. Only 2-9 yeah. for the Weaver, Weaver, which is the leading hero in terms of network for Wings Gaming. And Wings, 
They are starting to wrap around this tier 1 tower in the mid lane. They will be looking for blood. The tier 1 tower is very low on HP. They have the vision. Here comes the disruption. Lashrak is here. Here comes the arrow. It won't connect, but the stun from the Lashrak will hold Dazzle into position, not allowing him to cast any skill. And that will be the seventh kill for EG. And they might go for an early tier 2 tower in the mid lane if they mm -hmm. want. Wings is not in the position to counter this. And I don't think, and I don't know what will Wings do. Pero EG making their way into Wings jungle. And they might go for the tier 1 tower in the bottom lane instead. I think they should have given a, a little bit more space for Disruptor just to get him to that level 6. Malapit lapit sa level 6. Kasi oh, pero ito, pinabalik. Tignan natin kung anong laban. Pinabalik si Dasin. Ay, si, si ST. Pero mukhang makakatakas. Wala wow, ko balay, balay. Nakatakas, nakatipi naman. At uh, ganun, ganun lang. Yun nga. Kinakait ng EG ang uh, Wings buong team. Yeah. Buong another team. wasted uh, ult form like an... I believe, really, na kailangan nila gamitin itong more efficiently. Use it for push or for to take an objective or for a kill but they've used they've been using this very defensively and i don't think that's a good sign for wings gaming oh and at match point at this point yung uh, diabolic dito is sobrang lakas pa so they also even they even have a way to scout the the three lines dito behind the towers they have that rocket yep. player coming in from that clockwork which will give them vision behind enemy uh, behind the tree line so they know if ever there is a wing zero lurking behind try, well, that will try to deny or try to initiate don and they are clearing etong uh, mga towers ng wings with ease weaver is actually very poor right now especially the lycan lalo na kung i-compare mo sila sa course ng EG and then Nakahuli, na ako 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 Yes, well, kasi ang uh, set nila doon will mm. be the arrow and of course the stun coming stun. in from that lash. But once the disruption, it will be hard to, it will be very hard for EG to land those skills. Although this is too early para doon sa factor na yun since yep, magre, that's true naman. mabilis mabubuhay si uh, SD dito. Kahit mali mabeses pa siya mamatay. Oh, SD level 4 na lang ako forever. At ito, binalikan niya lang yung uh, observer dito. At saan yung isang stat niya? Na, saan yung nilagay? <laughs> Apat lang yung meron eh. I Ako. think he's holding on kung gusto niya. Ako, may maganda yung position ng Disruptor dito kaso wala siyang ultimate. <laughs> may, ah, wala nga. <laughs> kung may ultimate siya, makakakahuli siya rito. Pero alam mo, tingin ko naghihintay lang siya ng magtitibi yep. tapos mababalikin niya. Mm. Uh, yung ano, uh, stragglers. So, tingin, tingin mo naman, oh, they are allowing EG to take down a tier 2 tower in that bottom lane and that will be the easiest access point to Roshan if you are on that region side and you allow EG to take that. So this might open the window of opportunity for EG to go crushing into that rush pit for that Aegis advantage which will further enhance their grip for this game. And here comes Smoke EG. Relentless pressure from EG, mga kaibigan. They are going after objective, objective, yeah. kills, objective, kills, objective. And they really want to knock Wings out of this Boston Major Tournament. And here comes We're the... Catch oh my Shadow. God. Si Shadow, oh, mga kaibigan. That's painful. Isa na lang siya kanino. Joko, Lord. Sakto rin kasi yung night time for... Or, oh yeah. Sakto yung night time, kaya rin hindi masyado nakakilo si Weaver doon. Kung nakita mo, hindi, siya, hindi man lang siya nakapagsukuchi or timelapse. Sobra, yun, kasi sakto yung night time, na-fog siya lang masyado. But, At EG... At mukhang kukunin pa nila yung ancient stock dito. I think they should. They could. They have the Luna, so... Uh, with Dragonlance. So yeah, I think they can, but... Safe dance. Respect the respect the wings gaming. Okay, now that and meron ng ulti lahat ng members ng wings and I think they should try to make something out of it, especially with the DD rune on the lycan and the blood bloods. Okay, black cluster item for the lycan. He only got the bloods and I don't think he will be able to dish out the damage that he wants. Maybe he can just kill him, which will 
yep. third things around para sa side ng EG kasi yeah. pwede nilang ipahabol yung la, yung mga ibang mga teammate nila like sa like an illusion yep. once na ma-disrupt nila yon and it's easy to burst down yung heroes na ang wings gaming Although, ang ace nga naman nila dito is yung Static Storm and yung Shallow Grave. True. But I don't think that would be too much now that EG has all their items. Pero uploaded. although everything is going in, in the way of EG dito, the momentum, the gold, the laning phase, we don't underestimate Ay, the yeah, hearts of true. the champion. The champion is the champion. Pero eto na ang opensa. Oh my God, Burado agad si Disruptor player. dito. Here comes the hook shot. Here comes the Mirana with the Universe. Star Ball. They immediately take down two. And under the protection of the MLS or Moonlight Shadow, they won't lose any heroes at all. And they might go crashing in for the mid lane wow. for the tier Universe 2 tower. making a very good play. Rocket Flare hits before before the Disruptor can can make a skill tapos na nakapag-initiate na kauli na naman sila rito but it will be the weaver being able to use the time lap instantly to avoid death yeah. as i was saying yung vision with the rocket flare on point with universe and then after that he landed the hook shot very good place coming out of the, one of the best of laners here uh, we have actually for me universe yeah. <laughs> is one of is the no, I di pa la. Siya ang favorite ko, play, player. Ako si Ice 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 pala yung... Ah, uh, okay. Si Timber, so oh, oh, play Ice Ice Ice. Idol. Yan ang, uh, idol. Si Idol Ice Ice Ice. Ayaw niya mag-carry, no? Ang galing niya mag-carry nung TI6. TI Pero hindi, gusto niya bumalik sa offlane eh. Sino? Si, oh, si Ice Ice Ice. Okay, okay. Very good. Tennis to stop, Although hindi ganun kalaki yung kalamangan ng Luna pagdating oh. sa network natin, it is actually 7-2 for Luna, 6-6 for Lycan. So, marami pa rin pera dito for that mm -hmm. Lycan. Although, he, I think he really needs that BKB in order for him yes. to assert dominance and dish out those damage. Yes. Pero with the way EG is playing this game, with that kind of wards, even the wards, <laughs> spotting that uh, smoke smoke rotation and another word there okay ay pero mo kung alam na ang gagawin ng uh, wings dito eh they are inside the rush pit actually but can they take this they yes, have they the can. amplified damage oh, but that rocket they are again. being scouted by that rocket oh. player and they eh, EG Universe. they have complete vision over the rush pit dito tignan natin kung ano mangyayari can clockwork hook into this Bangalow, arrow will fly tignan mo tignan natin dito Lycan oh my god this will be this will be chaos Lycan getting that Aegis though but here comes Oi, clockwork, and this they will take down the Mirana and this Raptor going down as well. One for one trade at the moment, but they will lose the Slardar. They will lose the Aegis as well. So EG is actually in control of this engagement. Lycan will be disrupted into a stun, and he will immediately be killed. Three for one trade. EG loses the Mirana, but yeah. Wings will lose the Lycan, the Slardar, the Disruptor, and the Aegis, and EG is in a row. Pwede mo natin makita yung fight recap. Gusto ko lang makita yung damage Di natin done natin na yan actually. Ay, hindi mo nakontrol. But yeah, um, actually, Mirana and Universe, they have the same idea to steal the Aegis. Kaya lang, hindi, hindi nila nagawa eh. And kaya dahil doon, naipit yung Mirana, kasama yung Lycan. Mm. At yun, dahil doon, <laughs> doon siya namatay. But, Again, the damage output from EG is still superior at uh, this point of the game. If if we could just see the fight recap, pero hindi. Pero kung makikita nyo, yung Pulse Nova ni Leshrak, sobrang daming damage yung nagawa. Oo, oh, totoo. Eh, so early to mid yung damage ng Leshrak Lesh talaga. Yeah. Ikaw lang ang hero sa Dota na ang skill mo, lahat damaging skill. Ah. <laughs> wala, ka pang lightning, wala ka pang lightning storm dyan, mm. di ba? Yun pala, four staff coming up from uh, another way to deal with the Lycan. And longer initiation for most of the Evil Geniuses team. And now they're gonna look to use the Moonlight Shadow. I MLS? Think na naamoy nila, naamoy nila uh, nandito pa rin eh. This, there is the MLS being used by EG, but itong okay, uh, Wicks, they are actually prepared. Oy, Whoa, bro, this grabe naman defensive yun. Disruption. Defensive disruption. But will Mirana die? No, he no, won't. He and won't. EG will eliminate three heroes on the side of wings and this might be it too early to and go but 
Whoa. EG, the perfect game, the perfect timing, the perfect everything for them. Working, the disruption, the MVP of that engagement, allowing yeah, Mirana totally to leave, even though he is caught by that Slytherin crash, by the ultimate of the disruptor. That just one disruption can things turn around, uh, can make things turn around in the favor of EG. Wings Gaming, they have the right idea. They had the good jump on Mirana. They have anticipated it with us with sentry the ward. sentry ward. Kaya lang, yun nga lang. Pero masyado yatang malaki yung kalamangan dito. Yeah. And things getting worse para dito sa side ng uh, Wings yep. Gaming. Now that Mirana has completed the Aghanim Scepter. Scepter. They, they are now facing oh. Double Star Storm. The Eclipse coming in from the Luna. The Pulse multiple Nova. skill damage coming in from the Flesh Rock, the Rocket Flare. And if they initiate on one hero, they actually, the hero composition actually of Wings Gaming is good at picking up one yes. hero at a time. They have a Slardar, physical damage, right-click damage, like an they Weaver. They actually don't have any AoE at the moment. Apart but, from so, the ang kainan ng lineup dito ng Wings is kung you are trying to kill one hero at a time. One disruption can interrupt uh -oh. yung chain o oh, na pwede nyong gawin can buy time for EG to yeah. react. Eh yung EG, kaya kayong burain sabay-sabay yes. dahil dun sa skill nila. You don't have BKB on your lineup. EG will just okay. take this game out. At Weaver to Matakas, Arrow will fly, uh, they will catch the Weaver. No, Actually, they won't. Hmm. And Weaver will escape. But yeah, I think all of those skills paired up with the Soul Catcher from the Shadow Demon, that makes really... Sobrang lakas talaga ng lineup ng EG ngayon because of that Soul Catcher din. Uh -oh. that's, that's their key to burst down the Wings game. Oo nga, yung dami na nilang damage. May Soul Catcher pa sila. So, amplification of 30% damage sa mga dun sa tatamaan ng Catcher dito. Yeah. Well, actually, Just isa lang naman siya. Kaya nga, pag kinakas mo yun, kinaside mo sa gigas. Uh -huh. Kailangan siya lang yung tatamaan uh -huh. ng Catcher. <laughs> Now, okay, that's this is a Wings Gaming is between a rock and a hard place. So, and pa bang in yan? But, like, I'm here opted uh, Necronomicon build. I think BKB pa rin talaga. Alam mo na kung kita na ako ng isang game. Ang uh. score 225. Okay. Tapos may like an yung kabila, yung 2. Sila yung nanalo. <laughs> Sila yung nanalo. Push, eh, no? Yeah, ano yun, sa pub ba yun? Hindi, hindi eh. Competi ah, compe mm -hmm. Competitive ko nakita yun. Ihong pa nga yun eh. Kailan pa yun? Noong time yun? Sa uh, Ihong Beachy Gaming. Sila ay size-size ah, okay. size yun. Wow. Oh, yun. Kasi may may certain period of time na sobrang lakas ng Lycan picks. Lycan na mag-push. Lycan yung ano talaga. Kahit anong gawin mo, makakapag-push at makakapag-push siya. Magbibikibi lang siya, necro, tapos atake, back, ganun lang. Makakapush agad siya. Okay. Hey, pero Slardar being spotted. Nagaamuhu yan dito. Uh, no? Pero... Lesh will immediately TP out of trouble. Here comes the movement coming in from Wings. They are looking for a kill. Desperately looking for a kill ang Wings dito mga kaibigan. But they are... Uh, EG is not giving them the opportunity to get it. Uh, if ever makakita man sila, sila yung mauubos dito. Here comes the MLS however coming in from EG. They want to go for this. There is... Another sentry, ward. sentry wards. They have catch the Disruptor. Here comes the ultimate. Immediately taking down the Disruptor. Pero Lycan, gusto niya pumasok dito. Slardar going in. But there is a brief lag at the moment. Nakakabakbakan dito. Lesh Rock start so catching damage. two. They've managed to kill three again and Wings. What is happening to the TI6 champs? They are about to lose this game. EG now up by 17 kills. Marching towards the mid lane dito and I don't think Wings can stop this. No, they can't. They don't have the tools to deal with this. They don't have a good wave clear. Na safe. Actually, they don't have any wave clear right they now. They don't have any wave clear. They don't have any way in the clearing yung creep wave dito. Oh. Ang, uh, or preventing a push. Pero etong EG, medyo clinical yung oh, laro nila rabbit. rito. Respect, eh. respect talaga. Oh, hindi talagang, uh, we will not yeah, uh, be, be overconfident. We will not. Yeah. Single eliminations. Everything is on the line. EG decides to be disciplined. I think it's the right call. They don't, they, they don't have any reason to push down in sa gitna. Now that Wings Gaming has responded, actually they will back. Ooh. 
they won't try to force the issue at the top tower. Maybe because they don't have ultimates on uh, Mirana and the uh, Luna. That's why they back don't up. actually need the but ultimate. But they don't need it. You no. don't need the ultimate of Mirana if you yeah. are planning to go for a hard round and push. Dahil, um, even though may mm -hmm. sky, you are fighting under the tower yeah. of the opposing team. So I think wala just yan. discipline lang talaga. Uh, just they discipline don't want that. to. Ayon commit ng mistake. Yep. Okay. Use Scepter now on the part of Lesh Rock. Pwede niyang gawin defensive or more importantly, pwede niyang gamitin offensive to. And pwede yung disruption na ngayon ni Shadow Demon is used uh, sa, uh, sa ibang way. And use that Use Scepter just to set up. So more tools to deal with coming from EG and ito na <laughs> Shadow Demon Illusions. So, oh, eto. Tingnan natin kung anong BKB plano dito lang. BKB on uh, RTZ. Mm. This is getting really out of hand for Wings Gaming. Delikado, delikado ang mga kaganapan at ang mga pangyayari rito. Okay. Well, uh, Wala akong even, maisip na magandang point para dito sa Wings eh. Uh, They are losing this game really bad. Really badly. Well, yeah. Kaya man naman si Lycan. Ewan ko, pag may Necro 3, baka magbago ang mundo. Di ko alam. Di ko sure. Pero feeling ko, hindi ganun yung bibitawang wings dito. Oh, they... Uh, kasi, the thing, if you want to go with Necro, you want to push talaga. You want to push as 5. But I think that the, it is too late to this game na ganun yung pick up mo, na Necronomicon. I think you could have done better with a uh, blacking bar, for example. Kasi hindi rin, ano eh, or, yeah, I think blocking bar would be better. Para lang hindi sila masetapan ng mga, kasi actually wala namang nag-go through BKB. Oh, pero naku, nakahuli na naman sila no. rito. That MLS mga kaibigan. Um, Arrow, <laughs> Dazzle, he will be able to trigger that weave or uh, the shallow grave as well. But he will still die and there will be no backup coming in from the teammates. Pero Rosha na yung magiging susunod na objective dito. Gem is picked up for the side of EG. Another way to stop yung... Uh, another way to nullify the ways to deal with nung Wings Gaming is to remove that vision from Wings Gaming. And very disciplined coming up from EG data. I'm really impressed. You know, I've been watching EG for a lot of time. Hindi sila ganito ka discipline. Discipline sila na konti lang pero ito sobrang discipline. They want to really systematically take this game and take the 2-0 against the defending champions of the international. Oh, pero ito tignan natin dito. Blade Here comes mail. Wings. They want to go for an engagement clockwork hook won't hit anyone. Lycan is in the four pero ito tignan natin ah. Oo, and they will oh. take down Lesh and there is a fight left on the side of Wings dito. Sibi mo, kapag nakakuha ka ng support kill na 700 gold ang worth. Ganun ka, ganun kayo ka behind oh, ganun kayo ka baba sa net worth. Okay, but the thing is, uh, as we can see, even universe with the items that he has, nagme-meltdown pa rin against dun sa wolves lang ni Lycan. As you can see kasi dahil sa mga minus armor. So, Wings Gaming, they have the damage output that that can deal with EG. Pero wala sila nung proper disable at proper ways to control yung snowball ng damage output coming out from EG. Oh, and another very good item coming in from the Mirana, skipping that dagger and yeah. going straight for, for ethereal, a blade. ethereal blade. Which can be used offensively or defensively. Okay. Since more on right click nga naman ng wings, why not, di ba? Just decapify mo yung maatake sa'yo to burst him down while also preventing him to attack. Okay. 4 to 21 scoreline. And, uh, well, kung ganito, ang 4 to 21 scoreline, hindi naman siya ganun ka, ano, actually, ka laki ng diferensya since hindi pa naman nakakakuha ng tower ang uh, EG dito. And yep. I think, they are playing this game too conservatively. Dahil may at some point sobrang laki ng kalamangan ah, yeah. nila. Hindi nila ginagawa. 
uh, to take down objective. They are yes. not taking enough risk for them to win this game. But now they are actually split pushing. I think ko na alarm na sila di. I mean pushing. I think ko na alarm na sila dito. Here yeah. comes the split push actually on the top oh, lane yes. coming in from like the Lycan. And this is it, mga kaibigan. This might be a uh, race Whoa. for the rocks. Pero the for they have no fortification. Yeah, okay. No, actually they have. But they will lose the tower. Here comes the Slardar with the initiation, but immediate four step coming out from the side of EG. Yes. Here comes the next engagement, mga kaibigan. Tignan natin kung ano mangyari rito. Oh my God, Luna Moon pang nahuli siya rito, but he has the AGs and he has the BKB. Manta style will available. There's a defensive disruption, and they might go for this. Luna Moon pang will go down, and he will trigger the SS. And he, but he will die. So walang wasil baldasyan. Pwede natin dito. Slender and crash again. And here comes Wings Gaming. They are actually pushing back. EG. At uh, magkakaroon ng bakbaka dito. Luna is too, actually too soft. And he will die. Wings Gaming. Yeah, at the cost of their... Billy Rock. Suli na yung laban nila actually. rito. Okay. The thing is, I think RTZ... Ginamit niya kasi yung BKB niya bago siya mamatay. Kasi yung mga two hits na lang siya bago siya mamatay. Tsaka niya ginamit. Yeah, I don't think that's a good judgment coming out from RTC. Siguro medyo na-complacent na, na siya na mukhang in the bag na yung game eh. Although, the Lycan was able to take down a tier 3 tower at top. So, yeah, the BKB now. Okay, now, now the Wings Gaming has their tools na to deal with EG. What they're gonna do is to put Lycan on a split pushing role. And then defend with all the all they can using yung heroes na meron sila. But I don't think that EG will fall to the same trick twice. I don't think na malaloko pa sila ni Lycan at I don't think mag overextend sila as what they did at the past. No, British. actually, I think I, I know the strength of ano dito, of Wings Gaming. They are actually getting yung mga items na kailangan nila in order to at least get some momentum. Uh, on their side dito sa laban natin na to. The Slardar now is actually playing precise initiation. EG needs to be careful though. Uh, during the draft, tiyag usapan natin yung strength ng lineup ng Wings. They have actually very good reduction pagdating sa armor. And with that Lycan, if ever may BKB na siya ngayon, eh, he will now be able to at least take a hit or yep. even uh, take down yung mga yep. For sure. potential target dito sa EG. Luna needs to be careful. Nakita naman natin, meron lang siyang Aegis kanina. Kung walang mm -hmm. Aegis yun, that could have been an easy team fight uh, in favor of Wings. Yeah, I think yung supports now ng EG have to be concerned. They can be burst down by this like and easily with that BKB purchased. Although they have, uh, ano kasi, they have kiting tools now. They're going on in this like and Use to set up. No follow-up stun. Oh, okay. hindi na. Hindi na. Alam mo, he could, he could have used the BKB yeah. to... May TP ba siya nung time na yun? Meron, di ba? Wala. Wala. Kasi nakagalaw siya eh. Pero feeling ko... Meron, meron pala. Pero hindi niya... Hindi niya gina, feeling ko, kinonseed niya na yung buhay niya ron. Yes. Um, he will use the BKB for the next engagement. Much more better. That is a 10-second BKB that you yep. don't want to use. Dahil pwedeng pwede ka rin namang mamatay doon. Even yes. eh, wala naman kasiguran. Even if you triggered your BKB. But they might, he might get that kill on the Disruptor. They are chasing him. Pero Disruptor dodging yung uh, point of ng attack ng ano rito. And Weaver is, 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 uh, is in the mid lane trying to fend off a push coming if in from EG. EG, the, the MLS will expire. Tignan natin dito. 17. Tignan mo ha. Hindi mo alam ako. Hindi ko mapaliwanag, di ba? 522 is the score. 17,000 in terms of network ng Luna. Pero, magkalapit lang yung Lycan, Mirana, and Weaver dun. Hindi mm -hmm. ibig sabihin, may pera pa din eh. Itong uh, Wings Gaming. And I don't know kung paano nagkakaroon ng pera na ganito. Pero, uy, maganda rito. Kasi, ang next item ng Luna is a Butterfly. So, Yes, well, another well, way to problem. Deal with, uh, another problem para dito sa side ng wings na kailangan nilang i-address. Yes. Now, uh dito. With Wings Gaming, the way they found the farm is actually through their jungle. With all fairness kasi ganito lang gagawin mo eh. Kung kinoconquer nila yung side nyo ng jungle, for sure most of their heroes is nandoon. So what you do is go to the other side of the jungle. Uh Hindi mo lang ito magagawa against an alchemist. Pero against someone, uh, sa a lineup like Luna, what you do is, sige, hayaan mo sila mag-conquer nung Radiant side of the map. Farm nyo yung dire. That's why hindi sobrang under-farm tong Wings Gaming. Na-maneuver nila yung map. 
for them to find the most efficient way even when they're coming from behind. Ayun. So tingnan natin dito mukhang magkakaroon tayo ng scrimmage dito sa bottom part of uh, the map which is uh, the Radiant Jungle. Here comes EG. They will be looking for a kill pero magkakalayo ang Wings Gaming dito. They have someone in that mid lane trying to farm. Here comes the MLS. And there is the hook shot won't connect. Here comes the Weaver instead. And uy! Ganda! They managed to catch up the Luna Moon. Pang Luna immediately triggering the BKB. Here comes the Static Storm. Pero hindi, pero immediately, Disrupt Floor will die. And here comes the Luna. BKB, Slither and Crash. Nagahabulan portion na rito. There's the Necro Book. Immediately killing. Trying to kill ito. Pero the Lycan, mga kaibigan. He is very low on a, I mean in Weaver. And here comes Wings Gaming. They they will try to bring down two. Slarder is being chased down here. Dito. Pero lumalaba pa. And here comes the, the Weaver. And Weaver, he will take you down. Mirana limping in. That is a very big problem. And EG, they will lose four. Universe is the only one alive. And he might die as well. Pero Dazzle is here. Dazzle is alive. He will go down. There's the crash. And there's the tool. Team Wipeout EG will be wiped out. And Wings Gaming, they are they may lose a lane, but they are back in this game. Weaver surviving, Lycan surviving, and more items to come. If you are behind this big in a game and you manage to wipe the team that has a very significant amount of lead, yung gold na grab natin dito, talo pa ang, ang Mount Everest. Ganun kalakas. Abangan mo ang pagkakit niyan, Junko Lord. Anong nangyari, EG? Ayun nga. Napakaganda ng timing kasi ng BKB debut ng Weaver at ng Slardar. I think, even si RTZ, makikita mo na surprise siya. Bakit biglang may BKB itong Weaver? Bakit may, biglang may BKB si Slardar? The BKB timings were perfect for the side of Wings. And that's why they won the, that skirmish. And... Yun ay super weakness na EG. They've they've been reliant on their magic damage, on their skill damage, and once na makapag pick up na ng BKB purchases tong part ng wings, eh mo wala nang sila na damage output. And nakita mo naman, even with that, even with that butterfly, and, RTZ wala siya nagawa. And if wings will manage to take this game number two in uh, this best of three series, I think EG. I Nako. don't know kung paano sila makaka-survive mentally Nako. dahil you have this kind of a lead against the TI7 champ. Sabi ko nga sa inyo, you don't underestimate the, the heart, heart of, of a, a champion. champion. Lagi yung tatandaan yan. Hindi naging TI7 champs yan kung magpapastamp <laughs> lang ng ganyan yan. At uh, isa yan sa mga bagay na hindi may papaliwanag na siyensya. Yes. And Wings, they know, they know how to win. I think uh, may nang isang interview na they also practice playing from behind. They have the idea, the right idea to play from behind. Yun nga eh. Um, man maneuver around the map so you can farm more efficiently even though you're playing from behind. And pick up those nice items and hit your timings on the items. Yun uh -huh. nga, BKB. Napakaganda. And now that's... And uh, ito, um, wow. the problem here for EG, sasabihin ko na sa inyo mga basi, you have so much magic damage in your possession. You have the Lesh. The Luna, the Mirana going for an E-Blade and a Naga named Scepter. But you are now facing a tricore lineup of wings. All with BKB. With BKB and yes. all with super physical damage. And all with that armor reduction. Three seconds will be enough to kill the to kill any heroes on the side yes. of EJ at this point. And uh, as the game progresses, lalakas at lalakas pa ang uh, lineup ng wings dito. At uh, magsisimula ng mag alam mo ako kanina siguro mga 25 minutes into the game yung peak ng power ng lineup ng EG when Wings doesn't have anything on their side to mitigate the damage that EG is bringing to the table but now yes. the things have uh, turned. turned into Wings favor they have the BKB and EG they don't have the armor to compensate yung negative yung armor reduction yung damage amplification na meron yung lineup ng Wings gaming dito. And uh, another key thing to put to your mind dito, yung disruptor dito, once, dahil nananalo sila sa mga engagement, once na makakuha yan ng Aga yes. Scepter, it will be very devastating pag nahuli niya yung Mirana, yung Luna, yung Leshrak na yon. any two hero caught, between the, uh, caught inside that static storm, 
will immediately be useless, rendered yes. useless Parang into this game. 10-24. The score is, the, yeah, the end of the scoreline. But I think Wings is is now in the momentum complete right now. control of this game. Okay. The, uh, Wings Gaming will take control of this game for the next few skirmishes up until to the point na 5 seconds na lang kunwari yung BKB nila. Pero, um, um, yun nga eh. I think that Wings can win the game within that window. Unless EG, of course, will catch them off. Okay, off EG making a move. This is a very pivotal team fight if ever magkakaroon ng engagement dito. If EG will lose this badly, I don't think they will win this game. But if they manage to uh, win this uh, team fight and uh, il il makabatay sila rito, makakuha, matigil nila momentum ng wings, eh, Luna, ayun na. Luna is Luna. in a bad position. Uh, Luna is in a very bad spot. He might get caught dito. Pero wings mm, so. wisely will teleport into the safety of their base. Okay. Not engaging sa terms ng EG dito. Mm -hmm. is wings gaming. Yep. And uh, now... Talagang uh, walang ito la kabigan mala championship ang laban dito ng Wings and EG but EG they will Good go again game. for the Ages of Immortality they need this uh, to further hold etong laban natin na to but here comes Wings Gaming they They're are on their actually. way they will go they are going to contest and uh, Roshan they is low just might be but on time. I think this will be enough for uh, wings to go into the rush pit dito. Tignan natin mga kaibigan. Ito na ang bagbakan dito. Universe, si ang susu siya ang unang popronta rito. Pero hindi. Masyado na, ma masyado na malalim yan. And Wings will just concede the Ages of Immortality. And they will be happy and contented on split pushing. Grabe yung Weaver yung item niya, no? Okay, diffuse all and... Tatlong nice orb effect. Sa Dota 1, magkahang na yan eh. Yung PC mo. Magpapital <laughs> error na yan. Kasi bawal yung mga orb effect na yan eh. Na magkakasama. Okay. The game will crash. May nakalagay pa dyan. Pag magkakasama. Lifesteal, Skadi, <laughs> diffuse all, <laughs> ultimate, oh, uh, ano, Deso. Okay. EG will force this issue even though meron, uh, I think... Okay, mag split sila. Try, they're gonna try to split with the illusions. Although, I know, they're gonna, they're gonna AC, AC is now up on that Lycan. So, they have an AC, they have a Deso, and they have too many minus armor. So, furthering yung uh, ano nila dito. Kung bagay, pag nagbangga na kayo sa setup dito ngayon. Yung Yari. negative armor, <laughs> hindi mo, uh, kung baga, para kang umatngat ng ano eh. <laughs> na anesthesia dito sa side ng AJ. Di mo na mararamdaman yung katawan mo eh, pag binanatang ka dito eh. Pero ito, Universe is the key. He needs that on-point initiation, that clockwork hook, that clockwork hook to uh, make chaos dito sa backline ng uh, Wings Gaming. And the Weeb will be used by the Weaver dito. Uh, that will immediately put Wings uh, or EG into their back foot at uh, alam nila hindi sila pwede lumaban sa under the effect of weave dahil yung papasokin yeah. nilang base eh, medyo makate okay um items i think shadow demon pwede siyang mag pick up ngayon ng aganim scepter dito with three charges on the demonic perch one way to deal with the bkb nilibati ko nga pala si sarah barlis nanonood daw siya nanonood pala siya Hello, hello. So yun nga, I think yung Shadow Demon, pag, nag, pag nakakuha siya ng, ng Aganim Scepter dito, is very good against Wings because of how Demonic Purge works around BKB carries. So, in terms of important item pickups, I think that Shadow Demon should be heading to the direction of getting that Aganim Scepter. Uh -huh. Pero may hirap yun eh, yung uh, possession nila dito. Yes. And... Uh, well, Leshrak is turning out to be very hard hard uh, for position here dito. May Shiva's may Shiva's guard siya to compensate for some of those missing armor. Yes, and uh, and minus attack speed. A little bit of way to deal with it. Another weave coming out. Another weave coming out. Uy, Luna. It's actually kunwari, a kunwari fake Luna. Wow. Uy, pero ang ganda dito. Wow. Hook shot connecting on Weaver. Pero tignan natin kung Weaver will be able to time lapse. Pero hindi. Buhay pa rito. But they, uh, that EG, they managed to take off the set of racks in the mid lane, wow. giving them a very good advantage uh, in this game. Dahil dalawang yeah. set na ng ano. Uh, and Lycan ultimate is down. 
So, there is a very small window for of opportunity for EG to actually win this game. Yeah, win that game, and they actually hit that very good. Ano yun, na, na cut off guard yung Weaver without the Sukuchi. Tapos yun na, tinamahan siya na sobrang daming lanes. Ayan, not. But, oh, aray, 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 sakit. Aray, Ang sakit. Si Luna nasasaktan, si Weaver nasasaktan din dito. Here comes the Weave, here comes the Luna. However, wow, that hook, hook shot coming in from the clockwork. Here four comes stop. the four stop. And they might go or achieve mega creeps dito. Walang way ang ano rito. Here comes the... Uh, Sumail, oh, cutting down. Oh, si Sumail, he's on the back backside. Lines. And this might be... The GG, mga kaibigan, no way to stop the push. Luna triggering that BKB. And uh, is it too late? Too little para dito sa side ng Wings. At mukhang Wings Gaming will be wow. eliminated. They are up against a Mega. And they don't have a very good lineup to counter a Mega Crips. Dahil single target lang sila rito. Mukhang uh, na, na, narak sila rito. Narak sila ng EG. Weeb, maharap lang yung Luna rito. Slytherin Crash on two. Eclipse, Manta, too much damage. And Wings, I think they will be out and eliminated here. Smoke. <laughs> Pak, pumasok. Hindi, mahirap na lumaban sa cancer eh. Harap ni Luna kasi gusto niya kainin yung Aegis niya pero may static storm naman sa gitna dito. Disruption. And there's the disruption. Let's rock with the Diabolic Edic. Too much mga kaibigan, too much to handle for Wings. And naku po, anyari and GG will be called. Wow, perfect timing. Yun nga, sinasabi ko, nap napakaliit ng window ng EG para gawin yun and they hit it. What happened was, Weaver had no Sokuchi and he's under, in the middle of the barracks at yun, nag-bounce sa kanya yung Glaives. And then, perfect hook shot from 